welcome to Herald of Glory Devotional. Today is Thursday, January 19, 2023. The Lord's Word to us focuses on living by the Spirit. Ephesians chapter 5, verse 18 reads, Be not drunk with wine wherein is excess, but be filled with the Spirit. The Bible says, If we live in the Spirit, let us also walk in the Spirit. Walking in the Spirit is a secret to victorious Christian living. The troubles many Christians go through could be avoided if they learn to live by the Spirit. Romans chapter 8 verse 5 and 6 says, For they that are after the flesh do mind the things of the flesh, but they that are after the Spirit, the things of the Spirit. For to be carnally minded is death, but to be spiritually minded is life and peace. You must not have bad experiences in life before you learn to follow the guidance of the Holy Spirit. God your Father doesn't want you to learn that way. That's why he gave you the Holy Spirit. Romans chapter 8 verse 14 says, For as many as are led by the Spirit of God, they are the sons of God. What makes the difference in your life as a child of God is that the decisions and choices you make are led by the Holy Spirit. That is why you must give attention to fellowship with the Holy Spirit and be always filled with Him. That's how to walk in the Spirit. He cannot lead you when you are not filled with Him and full of Him. Our Holy Scripture admonishes us not to be drunk with wine, but to be filled with the Spirit. When you are filled with the Holy Spirit, it becomes easy to be led by Him. The pastor says, it is the Holy Spirit who works in us both to will and to do God's pleasure. He guides you into God's purpose and shows you how to fulfill it. Jesus said, How be it when He, the Spirit of truth, is come? He will guide you into all truth and will show you things to come. John chapter 16, verse 13. He doesn't only show you things to come, He guides you into their reality and manifestation in your life. It teaches you to be successful at every phase in life and to always win at every venture. You have the advantage in the Holy Spirit. Live by the Spirit. Practicalize today's word by making this declaration with me. Precious Father, we thank you for the ministry of the Holy Spirit in my life. I am guided in your purpose and plan for my life. By the Holy Spirit, I am successful every day and at all times. Jesus name. Amen. As your reflection, make fellowship with the Holy Spirit an essential part of your daily schedule. Be always full of the Spirit. Meditate on Luke chapter 4 verse 1 and Acts chapter 2 verse 4. With Herald of Glory devotional, every day is a perfect day. Pastor Julius J. Chrysler, Herald in Douglas.